This is Two Minute Toots, where we show you a digital fashion tip in two minutes or less. You guys know I love my quick tips and I have so much happening right now with my networking event coming up in two weeks, which if you are in the New York City metro area, you should come. There's a link in the description to um, purchase tickets if you're interested. And I wanted to make sure I used my time efficiently and yours. Plus, my recent online lingerie sketching class started today and I wanted to get myself in the mood for that. Now this tip is something that I pulled out of the archives, but it works just as well today as it did several years ago when I first discovered it. Scan or take a picture of your lace and open it in Photoshop. You want the picture to be black and white, black lace and a white background. So if it's opposite, choose image, adjustments, invert. And if it's in color, change the color mode to grayscale. And then go to the adjustments menu again and adjust the level so that the background is a nice bright white and the lace is dark and defined. Use the white slider to the right to adjust the background. Use the gray slider in the middle if you need the details to be a little bit more defined. And use the black slider to the left to adjust the darkness of the lace. Next, change the image mode to a bitmap. The output will default to whatever the document resolution is and the method should be diffusion dither. Then just do file, save as, and save the document as a TIFF. To use the file, open it in Illustrator, select the lace, and fill it with any solid color. You can even drag it into the swatches panel if you want to. So this becomes a quick way for you to color a lace and use it in a clipping mask, or you can save it as an all over lace pattern swatch and put it in different colors. And by the way, this is not exclusive to lace. It just happens that that's the technique that I use for this particular thing. But you can use this on any type of single color raster image that you want to be able to recolor in Illustrator. I'm Mikkel, your digital fashion guru. Thank you so much for watching today. Have a great week and I'll see you next time.